Paul, the wraps are off. You've finally seen it. Give us your reaction to Allenders. Well, it's not just it's not just the Allenders bar. It's just the facilities full stop. It's just absolutely amazing. Like I was saying to you, Craig, and thinking that what even for you, what a place to come for you to come each day to work. Everything about it, the facilities, everything that people can do, the bars upstairs, the executive bars, everything down to the all the CCTV and things like that. My bar, just eating in there now. The food, absolutely superb, and uh, it's just an honour, just an absolute honour, and that to come round and, and see everything. And when the chairman rang you just before Christmas, I think you thought it was a wind-up to start with. Yeah, definitely. I think it was a Friday night, and uh, I missed his call as a voicemail, and so it. Uh, came up with Dave Newton, I think, uh, and um, I looked and I thought, what, Dave, what's Dave ringing me for? And uh, I listened to the voicemail, he said, I'll give a ring back, and I rang him. And uh, he said about the new ground, and uh, he said, oh, would you mind would you mind if we had called the, one of the bars after you? And I was like, what a silly question. It, uh, of course, so uh, yeah, it's just, just such an accolade to have, I think, out of everything I've done in football, I think, which is one of the proudest things that, uh, that could have happened to me. And looking on the billboard behind you, it says 287 games. You were a real legend here. You played at every level, and manageable really. You won promotion, you had five years in the Football League, and then you even hung around when things got tough. You must review it as a really enjoyable part of your career. Yeah, definitely. I think it was from start to finish, everything from when I came in the conference to the league and then coming back. I enjoyed all, all my time here, and I think that's why I did come back. And it was uh, just great memories for me. And my, with my family as well, the kids were mascots during the game and my parents came and that supported me all the way through it, so it was uh, something I was very proud of. And it seems strange, your two children are now grown up, they're with you tonight, it's all changed, but do you still follow the club from afar? Yeah, definitely. Um, obviously I follow them on, on Twitter and that, that helps and that to see all the I've got notifications and that alerts from them, so uh, I always have a look and uh, obviously I'm in contact with you still and uh, just looking forward to when it's all back up and going and things like that, and the fans allowed and that, I'm just going to bring my family down for food and going to come and watch a game, so uh, just looking forward to it. And your involvement now is with Bottisford Town, I believe? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm there, I'm just an uh, um, assistant manager, so um, it's good, I enjoy it, it's, it's nice to be back in the game and uh, uh, I, miss, I miss the banter and uh, the crack, so it's, it's good. Yeah, do you, do you miss playing, is that? A lot of players move on pretty quick. But. Yeah, I'm pretty lucky to be fair on that because I'm still, I'm still playing in a Vets, vets, in a vets League over in Hull, so uh, uh, we play every two weeks and I get, get, still get the enjoyment out of that. So uh, it's good. But all in all, you'd recommend Allenders to anybody coming down to have a, a bite to eat? Definitely, definitely. For a family or anything, just uh, husband and wife or girlfriend and, and boyfriend and that to come down and that and uh, sample the food, it's, uh, it's really, really good.